Good evening guys, thank you for watching this, hope you're enjoying the modules that you're doing at the moment. Uh, if you're not, don't worry, it's nearly summer, we're almost there, we're going to be sipping bevies in the park. It's going to be amazing. Uh, what I'd like to try and do here tonight is pitch to a couple of you who may be uh, here over the summer, uh, during August. Um, and if you're kind of bored during that time, maybe if you want to get on, on a project that I'm doing with a couple of third years, uh, I'm looking to take it at the moment to UWE management. It's been fully supported by the Students' Union. I'm also looking to get UWE marketing on board as well. Um, I don't know if you saw the Beyond thing that I did back in March with Ed Burrell, um, who's also going to be on this one. Um, essentially what it was was a live television broadcast, live online television broadcast. It also streamed out through the radio as well. It's got the potential to be so massive, it is ridiculous. Uh, what we're looking to do this time is do uh, style it to an audience. The audience being freshers. Now, when freshers get to university, I mean, they, they're worried, anxious, excited, shocked. I mean, we're all freshers once we all know what that experience was like. And this show, called the EW Welcome Show, will essentially sort of address all of that, including some fun, and the release of the Freshers lineup show, and sort of like mould it all together to give the students the, a true student experience before they even come to university. Another thing that I think is like really effective about this show is that people can now, with the use of Twitter, hashtag or at symbol, and immediately interact with somebody else. People always seem to interact via music, which is one of the greatest connecting devices, I think, in the world. Um, and we all know how bad icebreakers were. The first day in icebreakers, I mean, it would, have been, it would have been a lot more awkward. I mean, it was kind of awkward because I went around shaking everybody's hand, but it would have been a lot more awkward if, uh, if I weren't there. Um, I think what we want to try and do is eradicate sort of icebreakers and use this as a, as a chance to really give people a, an opportunity to, to mix with other people before they arrive here in a city that perhaps don't really know about, don't really know to live here, and we want to try and address all these things. Um, like I said, a couple of third years already have, uh, have decided that they want to continue on from doing beyond onto this project, but there is a lot of opportunities uh, here for people who are interested. Um, I would I would hope that a lot of you are interested that are in the area for the summer. Uh, if you want more details or you would like to register interest, I'm going to put the email at the foot of this video in the comments. It's going to be the nth degree at hubradio.co.uk. Just contact me, we'll sort something out. Um, yeah, you're all truly skilled on this course and I would be pitching to you if I didn't think you were. Um, and I'd really like for some of you to get involved in this project. Um, it could be truly, and I think it will be truly and utterly rewarding. It's going to be hosted by the Students Union President as well, um, and I just think that we kind of owe it, we can't, I don't know, I don't know, I think we kind of like have this opportunity to really do something that no other university has ever done. We owe it to ourselves really. We've been working hard for two years. Why can't we just showcase now to everybody what we can truly do as a course? Let me know if you're interested. I'm going to shut up now. Probably going to get some bedtime milk and cookies. Um, I'm not really. Uh, yeah, get in touch. Cheers guys.